Do you use Instagram, Robin? Yes, I do. Now, what kind of pictures do you upload? Mm, selfies, food instas, maybe a throwback Thursday picture. <laughs> well, no offense, but Natalie, and she's here with us today, mm -hmm. she uses Instagram for a better purpose. Natalie is a professional photographer and she uses her pictures also on Instagram. Natalie, welcome. Thank you for having me. Hi, Natalie. Why did you decide to put your pictures on Instagram? I decided to put my um, pictures on Instagram because I live in Beirut, in the Arab world, and it was a good way to break uh, Arab stereotypes. So it was like showing the everyday life of wherever I was in the Middle East. Um, and it acted like a travel diary as well. And also for um, a new dimension for a story that I'm currently doing about um, Syrian girls who have left their home. Um, so they, it's an account for them to post what they miss about home. So what do you want to achieve with your photographs? Like, only not about the story, but more maybe? Uh, well, for the story and on Instagram, it's a different way of uh, showing, showing subjects behind the headlines and subjects behind the news. It's a different type of, it's showing people what they didn't, haven't seen before. Um, so with Instagram, it's, uh, you never see these type of pictures on the news. They're very slow pictures. Mm -hmm. um, and they're actually fun pictures. It shows the brighter side of the Arab world and the brighter side of the Middle East because there's so much tragedy going on right now. That sounds very inspiring to have a positive view on that. So thank you, Natalie, for sharing yeah. your story. And we'll definitely follow you and your photos on Instagram, right? Right, definitely. <laughs> thank you, Natalie.